Added to the 2007 release of Excel, tables are one of the most important features added to the application in 20 years. One of the primary advantages associated with using tables in Excel is formula replication, formulas that automatically copy up and down a column in a table even as the volume of data in that column changes. However, in some cases, you may not want this feature to engage. In this tip, you will learn how to disable formula replication in Excel tables. Suppose, for example, you use a table to calculate and track sales taxes due on taxable sales in the simplified example currently shown on the screen. Now let's further suppose that your state offers a sales tax holiday and cuts the sales tax rate from 6% to 0% for the first day of the following month. In this example, you would want to use a different formula for the sales tax column, which of course is column C, of the table for that day and that day only. However, editing the formula in that column for that row would ordinarily change the calculation for the entire column because by default, formulas always replicate through the entire column in a table. Changing the formula so that we are implementing a 0% sales tax rate for the first day of the month would in fact change the formula all the way up and down the entire column. To make a one-off formula in a table, enter the desired formula in the cell of interest and press enter. Again, that changes each and every formula in that column by default. With the new formula in place, immediately click the Undo button on the Quick Access Toolbar. Doing so causes Excel to restore the original formulas in all of the cells except the cell of interest. Of course, you could also use a Control-Z keyboard shortcut to effect the same change. Now, as you see, we have a separate formula in place for August the 1st, as opposed to all of the other days in the table. If you want to disable formula replication altogether, you can do that by disabling one of Excel's options. In the Excel Options window, choose Proofing, and then click Autocorrect Options. In the Autocorrect dialog box, uncheck the box next to Fill Formulas and Tables to Create Calculated Columns, and then click OK. Click OK to accept your change in the Excel Options dialog box also. Note that making this change in Excel's options disables formula replication in all tables and also in all workbooks. For most users, formula replication in tables is a welcome feature. However, there can be times when you need to disable this feature, even if only temporarily. As you have learned in this tip, you can easily do this by using Excel's Undo feature, or more broadly, disabling this feature altogether in Excel's options.